Hi, Chi. Good afternoon. Okay, how are you, Chi? I'm first. Thank you. Okay, teacher is doing great. What's the weather in Vietnam? It's hot. Oh, it's hot. Very hot here. Okay. So I will share to you the screen. Open the mirror of the mirror. So we are not yet done in 34 letter D chi. Let us finish 34 letter D. Letter D. Okay, so look up here in letter D, Chi. We are going to have here. Yes. Complete complete message. Okay. Jim didn't tell us what he did on Thursday. What do you think? Okay. Look at this picture. This is all about Jim. Can you please fill in the gaps the correct word that would fit in with the story? Okay. Please write your answer in here and we will discuss after. Okay, Chi? Yes. Right now.
Okay, Chi? We have here. Okay, here we are on Thursday. It was great. This story is all about gym. Okay, so here we are on Thursday. It was a great day. My ankle, okay, at the back. And then my uncle gave me and my friend, friend, Ben, a present. We opened it and found some clown clothes inside. We dressed up in the clothes. My uncle put on a big red nose. He was really funny. I put on some really big green shoes. I walk very well. We all laugh and laugh. Okay? So, correct? Yeah. Clown, we dressed Okay, the nose and the big green shoes. Okay, very good. So now we have very easy. Okay, which person in A climbed mountains when she was young? Actually, this is Daisy and this is Uncle Fred. Okay, which do you think? It's a big one. Okay, okay. so when I was young, I walked. 50 kilometers in one day. They see now, they see. Now I only walk to the shops. Okay. So, what is this answer? Who do you think, which person in A climbed mountains when she was young? Who is that? Who's that person? Who's that person? Who's that person? Who's that person who climbed? I see. Okay, it is. It is. Daisy. I see. Yeah, Daisy climbed. When I was young, I walked 50 kilometers. Okay, this is Brad. But Daisy said, when I was young, I climbed mountains. Oh my God. So, but now Daisy cannot do it because Daisy is already old. Yes, of course. Daisy will not do it because Daisy is already old. Now, we have here, Chi, please tell me or please try to encircle the difference. What are the difference between the pictures? One and two. Please encircle the difference. Uh. In picture one, they see who was dressed a Okay, so what can you say about the differences? What are the differences that you have seen in the picture? In picture one, they say was wear the blue jacket. In picture two, they see was wear red jacket in between one have three mountain in between two have four mountains in between one the weather is cloudy in between okay. two so weather is sunny. Okay. In picture one, in the okay. So first you can see that. Okay, what else? In picture one.
the soft up mountains has a big bear in big to two uh, stone half in picture one the boy is uh, hold the camera in picture to the boy hold the book Hey, Jace is wearing blue jacket here, but in here it's red jacket, right? She, the yes. weather is what you told me. It's cloudy, and here it's sunny. Teacher, mm. very good. Next, there are three mountains, three mountains. and here four mountains, right? Four mountains. Yes, very good. There, there's a beer, but here. Not a beer. There is no beer. Okay. Very good. The man is taking a photo here, but here the man is reading. Okay. For a while, just a minute. Okay. So, this one, there are five, right? five differences that you can see in the five differences that you can see in the picture. Now, let us play the game. Now, next to each name, write one thing that you know or think that each of the four people did last week. You can use the word, you can use the verbs from A to help you. Okay, first here, who did this? Write the names of the four people you know, okay? So, you can tell me who jumped, the people you know. You can tell me who jumped, who called, who wait, okay? Who show, oh, this is your own example, not mine. Not in the book, this is your own example. Just tell me who are the people who jumped, who are the people who call. Who are the people who, okay, so who are the people who wait, who show, who shout, who plant, who move, who play, who help, who change. All of these people, they are called as, they are, all of these words are verbs, okay. Please tell me now, who are the people who do this? Who are those people? Uh, Who are those people? Who you did? Who do you think are these people? Okay, the one who jumped. Do you uh, do you know anyone who know how to jump? Okay, the one who call. Do you know someone who call? Okay. Uh, my. Your. My. Dad. Oh, your dad keeps on calling. Uh, how about the one who keeps on shouting? Do you know someone who keeps on shouting? Do you know that? Uh, uh, Do you know someone who keeps on shouting? My, uh, my brother. 
your brother. Okay. How about someone who keep in playing? How about someone who keep on playing? Who are those someone who keep on playing? My dad and my brother. My dad and my brother. Okay. Okay. So, next to each name, write one thing that you know or think. Okay. Your dad and your brother keeps on playing about this. How about someone who keeps on planting or who do planting? Who are these people? Uh... My uncle. Okay, your uncle who keeps on planting. Okay, so this is all. Okay, now she look up this one. This is the example. Okay, I will give example. 50 lesson yesterday answered Alex. The answer is... Alex answered 50 questions yesterday. Okay, now look at Fred. Can you write or rewrite the words in alphabetical order? Can you rewrite the words in alphabetical order? Can you rewrite it? Fred. Fresh live near Fred live near the near the town zoo. Okay, very good. Fred live near the town zoo. Next, how about this? What is that? Ben Chan his jeans on Wednesday. Ben change his jeans on Wednesday. Okay, very good. Okay, good job, Jay. Very good. Okay. Now, this will be your homework. I will give it to you and We'll move to unit 35. Okay, so let's move now to, to unit 35. Okay, so today we're going to continue or we'll have what a morning. Okay, this is the topic on unit 35, what a morning sheet. Okay. Unit 35. We have here some vocabulary word like breakfast. Okay, the word breakfast is the meal that you have in the morning okay i've got a breakfast teacher very early okay what is your breakfast she i've got pancakes and i've got egg okay next here is the food okay can you see the food it's dinner okay dinner it's during night it's a meal that you have to do during night okay next is lunch in lunch time you will have this Lunch time, you're gonna have your lunch day. 
Next, we have supper. Okay, supper, it is uh, the food that you all have to eat, of course, during night, but it is lighter than dinner. So when you see dinner, it's actually a meal, full meal. But when you see supper, it's a, it means that you will have a lighter meal than dinner. Get up, okay? Wake up, get up. So when you say you wake up, you just still in your bed and you are like that. You did not, you open your eyes already, but you did not get up from your bed. So when you say get up here, you get up. This one is wake up. You just wake up, but you're not getting up from your bed. So when you say get up, you stand up and you do exercise like that. So that is get up. You get up already. Okay. Next is late. Yeah. Look at this shit. She is very hairy because he is late already. Late. Do you understand? He is in a hurry because he is quite late. Teacher, I am late. I am quite late. Okay? Do you understand that? So, he is yeah. late. Okay. Now, look up here the picture, Chi. And please answer in here this one in the blank the correct words we have here words please try to answer it okay okay chi okay do yeah. you understand okay please try to answer it please pick the word here just a minute chi Okay, so we're done here, yes. number one. Okay, for example here, children sit at desk and learn. No. Yes, and learn in this place. That is the classroom. Okay, number one, please try to read Chi. Number one. You can walk up or down this inside your home. 
Okay. You can walk. Yeah. Okay. You can walk up down this inside your homes. That is a stairs, of course. Number two. Wait here and then a drive first take you to town. Wait here and then a driver takes you to town. What is that? It is a bus stop. Okay, number three. What's number three? People. People is this in the morning is isn't lunch. Okay, people eat this in the morning. Break. It isn't lunch. It is breakfast. Break. Okay. Number four. You stand in this and wash your body. You stand in this and wash your body. What is this? A shower. It's a shower. Five. You put a hot coffee in this. Then you pick it up and drink from it. What is cup. that? It's a cup, of course. Number six, you can buy a map or look on the internet to find this. You can buy a map or look on the internet to find this. A place. Okay, it's a place. Yeah, very good. So you understand this shape? Very easy, right? Very easy, teacher Anne. Yes. Okay. Yes. Look at this one. Okay, by the way, I will just erase first. Okay, now look at this one. What happened to Ben? Okay, look at the picture and tell the story of Ben's terrible school morning. Why do you think Ben has a very or has a terrible day, school morning day? Okay, look at the picture first, then try, let us study the pictures first. Look at this. Oh, Ben and Ben and Ben and look at Ben. Okay. So, he looks at the clock and thinks, oh no, I must get up and go to school. Okay. So, what happened here? Do you think Ben at home now? Do you think? As you can see in the picture. Uh, yeah. Is he on the bus? No. No. Are his friends on the bus? Yes. Yes. Has he got his school bag with him? Has he got no. his school bag with him? No. Has he got a coat on? No. no. What's Ben doing? Uh, he's and what's the weather like okay look at that is ben happy why not okay what's ben doing now the first chief what's ben doing uh, this works uh in the uh, In the what's Ben doing? See, he walks in the street. He walks in the street. Is Ben happy? No. No. Why not? Why do you think Ben is not happy? Because he was uh, because he was class late okay because he was going to class late yeah very late is this teacher happy what do you think does the teacher of ben happy no no he's not she's not actually happy Okay, look at this one. You read the sentences that Ben wrote diary about his terrible morning. Okay. 
I got to school, but my teacher was angry when she saw me. Hey. I didn't have a shower. I put my clothes on. I quickly didn't have breakfast. Yeah, because he is actually very late. What a terrible morning. Every day, I wake up at 7 o'clock in the morning. But today, I woke up 8 o'clock already in the morning. So I am late on our band. It's really late. Okay. The teacher wasn't happy because I didn't have any books or homework. Oh, so Ben just go to school without books, without homework. I ran out of the house, but I didn't take my coat. I didn't say goodbye to my parents because Ben is actually very late. I ran to the bus stop, but I couldn't catch the bus. I saw it, but it didn't stop. I was very tired. Okay. I was very tired. Okay. And then, and my feet hurt because Ben is walking on the under the rain, and she is very and he is very he is very tired already because he is wet now. So all my friends were on the bus. Look at. But Ben is just trying to run after the bus, but the bus go already going to school. So I had to walk to school in the rain. Again, I had to walk to school in the rain. So, of course, Ben is quite scared about this. I didn't have a shower. I put my clothes on quickly. I didn't have breakfast. All my friends were on the bus. Okay. So, I had to walk to school. I ran to the bus stop, but I couldn't catch the bus. My teacher, the teacher, when Ben get inside the classroom, what happened? The teacher got angry. She wasn't happy anymore because Ben don't have or doesn't have any books or homework. I was very tired and my feet hurt. I got to school, but my teacher was angry when she saw me. I ran out of the house, but I didn't take my coat. I didn't say goodbye to my parents. Oh, that's so sad. No. This is what happened to Ben, okay? Now here, this is every day Ben doing. Look at that one. We get up and we have shower. We put on our school clothes and have breakfast. We put all our school things in our school bags, okay? So we put our coats and say goodbye to our parents. This is what Ben do every day. But this morning, Ben has a terrible day, a terrible morning. So we are here five. We go out of the house. We catch the bus. We get on the bus. We go inside the classroom and our teacher is happy with us. But what happened with this one? Hey, this is past simple. Ben got up but didn't have a shower. Okay, didn't have a shower. That's, we are talking here uh, about past simple. So, get, it becomes got. We put on our clo school clothes and put on our school clothes, have breakfast. Okay, we put on, we didn't put, didn't because past tense. We didn't put our coat we didn't say, we went out of the house, we didn't catch, we didn't get, we went, but went into the classroom. But his teacher was not happy, was not happy anymore, okay? So all you have to remember this, sheet in the Ben's terrible morning, it becomes past simple. Everything here is past simple. So God didn't. Can you see that there are lots of words with didn't. Didn't have, didn't put, didn't say, didn't catch, went, 
and didn't get. So everything in here is past simple. Okay. So what makes, what do you think makes Ben having that terrible day? Why do you think Ben has a bad or has a terrible day? Why? Why do you think so? Uh, Why do you think Ben has a terrible day? Why? Because as he's sleeping late. Last night. Okay, because he slept late last night. He slept, past tense. He slept late last night. Okay, because of that, because he slept, slept. Sorry. Because he slept late last night. The reason for that, Ben was late and ben wasn't able to get up early so got up early so therefore of course he was late okay do you understand chi you understand teacher yes. yes teacher that's the reason why okay okay we have here Ben or Nick. Okay. okay, look at this one. But look at Nick. Nick was very different to Ben. Storyable morning. Okay, let us listen why Nick is different from Ben. Why do you think so? Okay, let us listen. 35D. What a morning. Complete Nick's story. Write one word on each line. One. I woke up, then I got up. Two. I put on my clothes. Three. I got on the bus. Four. I went into the classroom. Okay, again. 35D. What a morning. Complete Nick's story. Write one word on each line. One. I woke up, then I got up. Two. I put on my clothes. Three. I got on the bus. Four. I went into the classroom. Okay, so what is the answer? Did you check? Did you listen uh, it carefully? Again, one more. Teacher will play it again. Yes, yes. Okay, okay. 35D. What a morning. Complete Nick's story. Write one word on each line. One. I woke up, then I got up. Two. I put on my clothes. Three. I got on the bus. Four. I went into the classroom.
Okay. Yeah. Okay, Chi. Yeah. Okay, so we have here next story is different from Ben. When Ben has a terrible day, a terrible night, or a terrible morning, but Nick is different because he is actually opposite with what Ben. I got up. Okay. Next morning was very different. I got up. Okay, here. Ben walked. Wait for a moment. Okay. I got up and had shower. I put on my clothes and went downstairs to the kitchen. I had a breakfast with my family when Ben didn't eat breakfast. Then I got my coat from the whole cupboard. I went goodbye to my parents and I go out from the house. I went out from the house. But, ne but Ben didn't say goodbye to the parents because he is really late. He's quite late. So that's why he didn't say goodbye anymore. Okay. When I went into the classroom, the teacher was happy, of course, because Nick go to or get inside the classroom earlier than Ben. And Ben is quite late already. Okay. That's why the teacher is not happy, uh, quite mad. Okay. So the teacher wasn't happy with Ben because he didn't have any books or homework. Yes. Of course, that's the reason that Ben isn't, or the teacher isn't happy with Ben because Ben just go inside the classroom without anything. He didn't have bags. He didn't have notebooks. He didn't have books. All Ben bring is only himself, okay? And he is also very wet. That's why the teacher got mad, of course, okay? If I am a teacher, of course, I will get mad Why you're very late. You didn't get up and wake up or get up early. So that's the reason because also Ben didn't slept earlier than what he used to be. Because probably he used to sleep at 8 p.m. But that last night, he slept at 11. So of course, he is very tired and he wants to get sleep a lot more okay so this is actually next story okay so on next day he on wednesday will be having okay yeah wednesday will be having ben or neck let us have to continue and let us identify which are the things for ben which are the things for nick okay i will just give the what's that i will just give the homework in zalo okay okay chi so for yeah. now chi we don't have time so teacher will wait for a while okay i will give the homework to you chi okay later i will give it to you Okay, so the lesson for today, uh, Chi, is just very easy, right? Very easy. You find it easy only? Very easy, yeah. Chi? Yeah, very easy, teacher. So I will give the homework later. This review. So for now, teacher will say goodbye because teacher Anne has another class. Okay, I will see you 
next class on Wednesday. Oh yeah, no, that's Tuesday, right? Sorry, I forgot. It is what yes. is our class Tuesday, right? We'll be having here Tuesday. Okay, I will see you on Tuesday. Okay, for now, she bye bye. Goodbye. Yeah. Have a nice weekend, she. Yes. Yeah.